Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your Six Tech. Today in this video, I'm going to show you the difference between a 5 gigahertz connection and a 2.4 gigahertz connection on your Xbox Series X. So I'm just going to do a quick speed test of the two. So let's go to settings and go to general and go to network settings. And you can see I'm currently connected to my 5 gigahertz connection. And then I'm going to go to test network speed and statistics and just check right here. So typically with your 5 gigahertz connection, you're gonna get faster download speed. But the drawback is it won't have nearly as good as range. So a 2.4 gigahertz connection, you're gonna get longer ranges, but the download speed might be a little bit slower. So depending on the position of your Xbox in your house, one might work better than the other. So if you have a five gigahertz connection that you're connecting to, this might be a little bit slower at further ranges than your 2.4 gigahertz. So you can go back and forth and just see. Here's my download speed. I'm at 224, upload is 22, and you can see my wireless strength is at 100% with this. So I'm actually getting, you know, like 100% of what I could be. Now let's go to set up wireless network and then refresh this list and connect to my 2.4 gigahertz, Mr. Beast. So excuse me for a minute, I'm gonna type in my password, no one look. And once I type this in, I'll be connected to my 2.4 gigahertz connection. And then, boom. You should be able to tell if you're connected over here on the right side once you get past the screen. So it's just checking the connection. And if you connected to this before, it should go quick. 2.4 gigahertz right here. NAT type is open before it was strict. So depending on the router you connect to, can change your NAT type. So let's go to test network speed and statistics. And then we're going to go through this loading screen, which can take 15 seconds for some reason. I don't know why it takes so long on the Xbox Series X. But once uh, we get to the other screen, we can see directly uh, how quick our speed is compared to the other one. So I'm thinking mine might be maybe like 125. So pretty much 100 lower. But you could see even significantly uh, different uh, download speeds and upload speeds, but depending on your network. So mine is only 109. So my upload speed didn't change at all, 22. My wireless strength is still at 100%. But I implore you to go ahead and try uh, the 2.4 gigahertz versus the five gigahertz at your home network. The 2.4 gigahertz, even though it's slower, might give you better speeds at further ranges. But hopefully this video did indeed help you out. If it did, leave it a big thumbs up. And subscribe to my channel down below for more tech videos coming up next on your six tech.